Hello, let me introduce myself. I'm Derwin Banks. I'm a farmer. I'm a very special kind of farmer because I produce linseed. Look at that, that's linseed. Linseed, um, I grow the linseed to produce oil which is cold, slow cold pressed and also grinded up to produce linseed meal. Um, today I'm going to show you how to use these two ingredients in an Olympic oxygenating breakfast. The reason for oxygenation is because oil is part of oxygenating the blood. Oils and fats are some of the most important substances to go into your body and thus some of the most abused. Well today I'm going to show you how to get really good oil into your body in a way that helps your body oxygenate itself. So here we are. I've got some quark. I'm going to put that into the liquidizer. Quark has sulfur compounds in it and it's quite a lot better for this process than any kind of yoghurt. So that's the quark. The quark you'll find on a cheese counter uh, in most big supermarkets. Next, in goes the honey, and this is honey from Barnes Green Bees. Did I say that's where we are? We're actually in my kitchen in Barnes Green, which is in the heart of Sussex. Today I've got some blackberries, which I'm going to throw in there too some blueberries and strawberries, so this is all part of getting your five day fruit in as well. And that all goes in there. This is enough for about three days breakfast for one person or maybe four of you if you're doing it um, for breakfast. And f the linseed meal in here, there's about six uh, dessert spoonfuls, so that goes in there like that. And finally, the key ingredient is the linseed oil so I'm going to put three days worth in there so that's one two three dessert spoonfuls and it's really really important to check your oil taste is imperative taste it if it tastes really nice that's great um, and check to see when it was pressed you'll all see a silver label on mine that tells you the date it was pressed now the juice Pop some of that in. If you make it too runny, you can always bung some extra porridge oats in. Oh no, I didn't switch it on. And there we have it. And of course if you're like me and you don't want to waste anything, a little bit of extra fruit juice um, in the liquidizer and you can do that uh, to clean it out. I won't do it now. But there you have Olympic oxygenating muesli and it is delicious.